podcast, and welcome to this week's Quad. I'm Kaden. And I'm Sushi. We have a few announcements, including a reminder that all lost and found items will be donated on April 7th, so be sure to check for any missing things. And for anyone interested in doing track, registration is open and the link to the final forms can now be found in the emus. Now, as many of you may know, both men and women's NCA tournaments have been going on for the past week. Our next video gives an update on the winners and losers of this year's tournament so far. Welcome to our special March Madness update. I'm Riley. And I'm Boyd. For the last week, many people have watched this year's best men's and women's college basketball teams play against each other in what is known as the NCAA tournament. And when the best of the best compete against each other, exciting things happen. In the men's bracket, 15 seed St. Peter's is making an incredible run having beaten the 2 seed Kentucky and 7 seed Murray State. And Baylor, a 1 seed, lost to 8 seed North Carolina. Up next is the Sweet 16 matchups. The women's basketball bracket also had its fair share of dramatic wins. Ten-seeded Creighton knocked out two-seeded Iowa with a three-pointer in the final few seconds. In South Dakota, another ten-seed took down the two-seed Baylor. There were many other incredible first and second round games in both brackets. And there will continue to be more as the tournament goes on. Back to you guys. Yes. Moving on to our next topic, we focus on today, March 21st. Introducing On This Day.